Hello and welcome to Favorite Rugby on Fair Sport. For today's preview, as the Harlequins and the Sharks are set for a blockbuster clash. Two incredibly strong sides being named by both teams. And uh, what should be, I mean, I mean, we're in London for the week. It's going to be a fantastic clash. I think I think this could generally be the game of the weekend. And there are some the fantastic games. You know, like I said, Leicester, Leicester versus Racing, uh, you know, 92. It's, it should be really, really good. Um, but I, I genuinely think that this could be this this could be the one to to remember because we're seeing a full string, basically a full string Harlequin side, a full string shark side, and um, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to see what happens here. And, and I think that it's been interesting to sort of see the different approaches from second sides with regards to resting some players and when they sort of really played their reserve sides when they haven't played reserve sides, for example. And the sharks seem to be taking this European Champions Cup pretty seriously. And uh, you look at the side they've sent over uh, to London, it's, it's yeah, you can understand. That's what sort of, for me, is the biggest indication that they really are taking the Champions Cup very seriously. They want to do very well in, in the Champions Cup. Before we look at the two sides, please do smash a like on the video. Please do subscribe to the channel as well. We'll start with the home side, which is Harlequins and uh, a couple of South Africans in there as well. Uh, so we look at the front row. It's Joe Marler, Jack Walker, and Vilko Lode. Vilko obviously will be moving to the Bulls next season. Uh, seasoned quality tight head. I uh, wouldn't look at this in the South African squad at all. That has been South squad uh, for a lot. Uh, Stefan Levis there as well, uh, former captain of the Harlequins, a uh, former Lions uh, player as well. South African born lock. Uh, Erno Herbst in, is, is his block partner. And in the, the loose trio, um, Dino Lamb, Will Evans, and Alex Dombrand, the captain side, massive Alex Dombrand fan. I think he's a he's a quality player, and I, and I really enjoy watching him. Danny K, Marcus Smith, that, uh, that uh, halfback pairing, which strikes fear into a lot of premiership sides, um, uh, hearts. Uh, so they'll be looking to try and sort of really penetrate that uh, Sharks, uh, you know, backline the defense and, and try and sort of upset that game plan. The two wings, Josh Bassett and Caden Murley. Andre Estes and Joe Marchand are an absolutely world-class center pairing. Andre Estes is up against his former side, of course, and will be looking to really have a go at the likes of Ben Tapawai, uh, Lekanya Amko and Bosch, uh, you know, two of his former teammates. And then Nick David at fullback. Off the bench for the men. Uh, from the premiership, it is George Head, Finn Baxter, Simon Kerry, uh, Tom Lauder, Luke Wallace, Scott Steele, Tommy Allen, and Oscar Beard. For the away side, the Sharks, this is what they've gone with. Um, and uh, Sia Khalees will captain the side. Uh, you should see him captaining a lot more these days for the Sharks, uh, despite having the kind of, um, there, having Thomas Toy there, um, who've all sort of captained before. But look at that front row Thomas Toy, Kieran from Fury, and Thomas the Toy. Uh, you know, it's 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 a it's it's a proper front row, and then you look at the fact that Dan Uister, Intu Kungunu, and uh, Carly Sardi can still come off the bench. That's proper depth, isn't it? Uh, in the in the in the rest of the tight five, we've got Ibn Etzebet next to Kabran Krabla, and this phenomenal loose trio: Sia Kalisi, Vincent Stuka, and Pepsi Butelezi. Um, you know, probably the best loose trio. I think are going to become the best loose trio in South Africa quite quickly. Um, if, if they also all hit their straps. Jaden Henderson, part of Kieran Bosch, who's, again, has been playing lots of rugby, feeling very confident as Kieran Bosch. Uh, Thakai Abrams gets an opportunity. You know, Makazuma Pimpi has been banned for um, a few weeks after alleged eye gouging incidents, so uh, he does miss out. So Thakai Abrams will get an opportunity to play a bit. Uh, as I said earlier, the, the tenth pairing of Ben Tapawai and Kanye Um, you think of Mark Porky to 14. Apple Fassi into the side in the 15 jersey. Uh, Dan Yuster took a Kuno Kalisari, those are front row, as mentioned. Hyman Andrews, Sikamoz, and Nochi covering the rest of the scrum. Grant Williams is into the side, and as he's with the likes of Lancrenier and Francois Fenter. So a quality starting 15, but also a quality bench. And I think. You know, the shark side are, are busy going through a bit of a revolution, you know, under under Neil Powell. And I think really starting to take some big strides, but the depth excites me. And, and I think that we, it was always going to be a matter of time, wasn't it? It was, it was, it was when, not if, the shark side does start firing. And I do think, looking at this 23, this is a shark side that really can start firing. And if they do start firing, can go all the way in, in most competitions, to be honest. Um, but yeah, so it should be a really cool clash. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. I want your score predictions. I want to know if you're going to be watching the game. Where are you going to be watching the game? Who are you supporting? Let me all know all of that in the comments below. Smash a like on the video. Do subscribe to the channel as well. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Steven, and I'll chat to you soon.